In this video, I'm going to show you three hacks to bypass LinkedIn weekly limitation on connection requests. As you know, LinkedIn recently changed the invitation limits from 100 invitations per day to 100 invitations per week. And this had a huge impact on the way people prospect on LinkedIn. However, there is still some acts that you can use to increase or avoid that limit. And I'm going to show you in this video exactly how I do to contact 300 to 500 people on LinkedIn every week. Let's dive right in. First act to bypass LinkedIn weekly limitation is to send connection requests with emails because invitation with emails are not counted into the limitation. So to do that, you can go on my network here, go to add personal contacts and click on more options here. And then you'll get several options to uh, invite contact through email. You can uh, add all your Gmail contact, Outlook contact, uh, OWL contact. You can also import a list of emails and a CSV. So if you manage to get the email addresses of your prospect, you can import uh, the file here. Here I got a file ready and then upload the file and LinkedIn will find the LinkedIn profiles that are attached to these email addresses. And once uh, the loading is finished, you get all the uh, LinkedIn profiles here. But the really painful things to do is that you need to check all the boxes here and then press add connection. And I think LinkedIn does that to limit uh, the usage of this feature. But this is really painful to do. So you can either get a huge motivation or maybe hire a virtual assistant to do this. But the good news is that some tools manage to automate this process and do it on autopilot. There is two tools that you can use to automate email invitation with LinkedIn that are La Grosse Machine and uh, Wallaxi. Personally, I use La Grosse Machine and you can see that, for example, this is the number of relation that I, that I had it in one day. So 55, if I check on this week, for example, like Saturday, I sent 69, uh, Sunday, 79, 29 here, and 55. So you can see that I'm clearly above the 100 uh, invitation per week limitation. So every time the Gross Machine will find uh, the personal email address or the LinkedIn address that you choose on the LinkedIn profile of your prospect, it will automatically send an email uh, invitation. One thing to know is that you don't have the possibility to add the connection note uh, with an email invitation. It will be a plain invitation with no note inside. I will leave the link of La Grosse Machine and Wallaxi that does exactly the same thing in the description of this video if you want to try these tools. Second hack you can use to bypass LinkedIn weekly limitation is to message open profiles. Basically, open profiles are profiles that allow you to directly message them without sending a connection request first. And I'm going to show you exactly how to detect and message this profile right now. A little disclaimer to message open profiles you need to have email credits and to have email credits you need to have LinkedIn Premium, LinkedIn Sales Navigator or LinkedIn Recruiter. If you go on a profile of one of your second and third degree connection you uh, need to click on more here and then message and if the profile if an open profile you will get the ability to send an email for free. So here you can check here free message. You don't need to write the subject like a regular email you can message person right away like this. And I will show you um, exactly how it looks like in the, in the inbox. So if I open my messages here, you can see that I have received the message of Leon, which is marked as an email. And uh, this profile has been able to send me a direct message without adding me and sending me a connection request on LinkedIn. There is something painful here is that you need to click on message to see uh, if the profile is open or not. But right now I'm going to show you how to quickly identify open profiles with Everboot in just one click. So here is what an Everboot extraction look like. And one of the common is prospect is open profile. And here I got true or false. But if I filter on true profiles here, you can see all the open profiles that you get on your list. And the really cool thing is that all these people that you see here, you can message them without sending them a connection request. So when you organize your album campaign, you can separate two campaigns 
one campaign uh, with open profiles where you send direct messages at the first step and a second campaign when you put the profile that are not open and you add this connection request step. But if you separate these two outbound campaign, you're gonna save time and save uh, connection request credits for your overall prospecting campaign. Third hack you can use to bypass LinkedIn limitation is to message LinkedIn groups members and LinkedIn event attendees. So as you can see here, I'm a member of this group. And if I click on see all here, I'm seeing all the group members and I can message them directly here without sending them a connection request. You're gonna see that this is exactly the same thing for LinkedIn events. So once you have signed up for the event, you can go on the networking tab here and you're gonna see that you are able to message um, anyone on this group. And I will message uh, my profile it says that we are connected, but uh, in reality, we are not. Um, it's a bug from LinkedIn, I guess. So I'm going to make a test here to show you how it looks like on the inbox. And the thing is that the inbox will not directly appear with the other uh, classic inboxes, but in, inside the message requests, and you can see that my message has been sent here. Honestly, I prefer the open profile technique because the messages lands directly into the regular inbox. With these techniques, your message lands into the message request. So maybe your reply rate will decrease a little bit. If you want to launch outreach campaigns on uh, event attendees or group members, you can use Phantom Buster to extract a LinkedIn group members or event attendees. Just go to Indeed to go on phantombuster.com and to use um, the LinkedIn uh, event guest ex exporter or um, the LinkedIn group members phantom here and you will be able to extract and get uh, the data and the LinkedIn profile into a CSV file and then upload it into your favorite outreach tool. If you want to know more about how to generate leads with LinkedIn and how to use Sales Navigator to build qualified lead lists, my advice is to check the two videos that will appear at the end here. Thanks for watching. I see you in the next one.